evening. We are out again on the search for some Halloween lawn haunts. Tonight's cities include Orange, Santa Ana, and Anaheim. Hopefully we'll find some good spooky displays to get us into the spirit. Just parked here for the Pirate's Cave Haunt in Orange. The notes that I found said this is the 21st year of their showing. Uh, we won't be able to do any sort of maze or anything like that, but it looks like there's about a 10 minute um, visual display that we get to watch that is about the history of the pirates. How many? Three? <laughs> Thank you. Hang out. Alas, there he comes seeking the origins of the pirate's king, eh? <laughs> Well, you've come to the proper place. The tale you're about to be told is not for the faint of heart. As will be played of Bibles and silver coins, stars, even the most salty of sight. Just finished up with the Pirate Cove Lawn Haunt. Uh, it's definitely worth coming out. It was a, about a 10 minute show. Um, they had a lot of uh, video and a lot of live action people. What would you give it? Should I give it my uh, scare, my scare rating? It only probably ranks up whoop whoop scares uh, for a step at the end, but overall uh, it was a good display. A lot of action kept you intrigued throughout the whole thing, so recommend. Yeah, considering you know that there's no haunted houses or anything, and so people have switched to lawn uh, haunts, uh, I would say this is the best one we've seen so far. So we still have two more tonight. Uh, hopefully they're just as good. Next up on our list for lawn haunts this evening is the Grim Grinners in Anaheim. We have made it to the Grim Grinners, and we're gonna take a look what it looks like. It looks like it's probably just a, a lawn display. fun. Um, the Grim Grinners are a bunch of pumpkin heads, I guess you could call them, um, with grim tales to tell. Um, ones that talk to you and leaping spiders. Uh, so overall, um, while it's not super interactive, there were some scare moments or things that jumped out at you uh, and made you jump a little. Our last stop for the evening is the New Hope Slaughterhouse in Santa Ana. Another one that doesn't really have much information, but I'm sure it will slay you. We found our slaughterhouse. It was a little bit difficult to see. It is on a main road. Um, New Hope is a main street going through uh, with full lanes of traffic, so we couldn't really park and get out. We just had a chance to drive by. It looked like the display had mostly scarecrow type things um, set up with some pumpkins. So not sure exactly the entire slaughterhouse theme, but um, it was our last one for the evening. And so we're headed home now. Happy Halloween.